Penguins have unique patterns on them. We have unique patterns in our fingerprints. Penguins have patterns on the spots in their chest. At least African penguins do. So this is what an African penguin looks like. Basically, it's a bird like this with a head, wing, or flipper wing, a black band, this is all black run here, and some spots inside the black band. Those spots are different for every penguin. So one penguin might have that pattern of spots, another penguin might have hmm, that pattern, shall we say. So if we can train a computer to recognise a penguin in an image, whether that image is from a camera that's in the field near the penguins or someone, a picture someone's taken and sent back to us, we can identify the spots. The computer picks out the penguin, finds this black band, and then finds the spots, compares the database, and we know which penguin it is. It's important because if you're a biologist and you want to know what's happening to animals, you need to know, for example, how long they live, you've got to keep identifying the same bird all the time, year after year after year. This way you can do it without ever touching the bird. If you do it traditionally, you have to put things on it which may hamper the bird and not good for it. And of course, the same system works for any animal that's got a pattern. So a leopard, a zebra, they all have spots. You might think they've got stripes, but the ends of stripes are spots. So it's very simple and very straightforward to do and very helpful for biologists.